Here we are at question 16. Let's see what we've got going on here. We've got a list of positions, people interested. So let's see, uh, we've got a high school is going to select a committee member or a committee. Committee will have a faculty member, male student, a female student, a parent, and a school board member, one of each. So one of each of these. Here are the positions and the people interested in each. So you've got, we'll have uh, in school board. So, so one of each of these groups will be on this committee. Based on this list, how many ways are there to fill the five committee positions? Um, okay, so first of all, since it's a committee, the key part of the committee is they're all equal members. So there is no ordering. There's no president, vice president, treasurer, secretary, that kind of stuff. So order is not important for any of this. Uh, since we have distinct groups, we're, when we're calculating the choices that are need to be made, uh, we take the number from each group and choose how many are being selected. We're going to select one from each group. So for faculty members, there are two here. For male students, there's one two, three, four, five, six to choose from. Uh, female students, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. And this one, there's one, two, three, four. And finally, for the school board members, there's one, two, three, and four. Okay. So I'm just going to, uh, you can see, yeah, two is probably going to be it. But what it is, it's um, so the way of choosing the faculty members, we're going to, out of two faculty members, we're going to choose one. And you're right, there's two ways to do that. We'll, we'll use the calculator to show. But uh, for male students, there are six ways. And from six possible choices, we're going to choose one. Same thing for female students. There are six, we're choosing one from there. And then for the parents, there are four. So we're going to take, of those four parents, we will choose one of them. And for the school board member, we will take four of those members. And from that group, we will choose one. Okay, we multiply it all together. Multiplication itself is commutative. So there, we really haven't ordered. It's, this does not have a particular order to it that we're choosing first the faculty member or anything. So this also order is not important. Okay, so I'll show you kind of a, a quick way um, that you can actually enter this into the calculator. I think it'll all work. We'll give it a try. So let's come over here. Um, so we're going to do choices because order is not important. Two and one. And again, if you remember this one, and we're just choosing one from the group, it's always sort of, you know, there's two ways to do it. We have either... Uh, who are the two people? Either Dr. Kelly or Mr. Alexander or Ms. Alexander. Uh, two pe two choices. Okay, but I'm just going to show you if, if it was a little different. Um, so we keep moving forward here. I'll click up there. I'll just go times instead of doing each one individually, and then we'll put this one here. We'll do the six and the one, and again you have to kind of click up here with your mouse. To get out of the basement, we'll go multiply. Uh, which one? So now we're still another choice for this female student, six. Come on. And one. And then get, get out of the basement. We have to click up, click up there. Uh, multiply another combination, four. Out of those four people, we're going to choose one. And then get out of the basement one more time. And we're going to the last combination of four and one. Now you could do these each individually if you wanted to check. But I'll bet you, let's see if I could do this in my head. We'll have a, a two times six is 12 times uh, another six. 12 times six is 72. Um, I can't, probably can't do this in my head anymore. 72 times 4 
that, that's going to give us 8 and uh, 28. And then we'll multiply one more time by 4. Um, so let's just give us a quick check. 4 times 8 is 32. 32, so that's a 5. Uh, 8 and 3 are 11. So 1,152. Let's see. Hopefully that's right. You just hit enter, enter, 1,152, see? So that's good. But again, this will work on any setup. If you are choosing so many people out of a group, uh, this is the way we do it, 1,152. So let's go ahead and enter that in, and then we'll move on to the next video, 1,152. And move to the next video, and I'll stop this one and see you when we get to 17.